those little city slickers we can't seem to escape. Social media seems to love them, while the rest of us New Yorkers tend to despise them. You have to hate rats. You know, New Yorkers, we don't like rats. They're everywhere. And I mean everywhere. On the streets, in the subways, in our cars. They're not too different from me and you. Just like us New Yorkers, rats know how to hustle and bustle and could always grab a slice of za. They even know their way around town. Okay, this rat problem is officially out of control. But who can stop them? We can't just release snakes on the subway. Or can we? Okay, releasing snakes isn't the best solution. But let's keep it real. While social media may have this weird obsession for rats, their exploding numbers are causing some headaches. So how can we get this under control? We need some sort of take no prisoners, rat wrangling warrior. Like we need um, uh, a rat czar. Wait, well, hold on. We actually have an official rat czar? Let me be the first to turn over to you uh, our new rat czar. Kathy, come say a few words. When I first saw this job posting, I wasn't sure if it was real. How does one become the rat czar? Wait a minute. What is a rat czar? Kathleen. Can you break this thing down for us? Absolutely. I am Kathy Karate, Director of Rodent Mitigation, New York City. That is so many rats, Michael. Rats are the symptom of systemic issues, housing, infrastructure, uh, a changing climate, environmental justice. These are all big issues that don't have a singular solution. So to get effective, long-term, sustained change, we're talking about changing the whole city of New York. Picture our city without rats. New Yorkers have built somewhat of a tolerance to seeing rats. No one likes it, but we're used to it. No Steve Irwin in my bloodline. As someone who's worked to fight rats since I was a kid, I know how important this issue is. I've spent my career focused on innovative programs to improve health and quality of life for New Yorkers. A czar is a title given to someone who kind of centralizes, oversees multi facets of government. And my role as the czar is to make sure we're all working in concert. Season two is back tonight. Only in New York. Ooh, day 100, we're definitely gonna take. We're celebrating day 100, look at that shit. And what we really need is New Yorkers to flip our thinking around this, making sure that litter gets in trash baskets, find a different litter basket to make sure we're not overflowing and leaving food out for rats. If you own a property, making sure your waste is clean, managed, making sure your property doesn't have any debris sitting around, those are all places that rats can live. We just completed phase one of an extermination study where Rose Hill Park actually in the Bronx, we saw it go from 50 boroughs to four boroughs, all through the use of non-poison treatments. We need you to get there. We need you to believe in that, have the buy-in and take the actions to help us get it done. You can check out nyc.gov slash rats and Department of Health's rat portal. And on that, you can see real-time inspection data from the Department of Health and Mental Hygiene to see if your actions are making an impact on your local rat population.